Hey guys, what's going on? Um, it's your girl Tally. What's good? Me getting off of work. You already know the drill. Uh, so I did make a video yesterday, but I'm I think I'm just gonna revamp that today because I, you know, I just don't want to be taken in the wrong way. So it's best that I just make another one. You know, that's just more uh, polished, if you would say. Kind of, because, you know, I still go there no matter what. But it is, what it is, is that, I need to just stick with what I know. What it is, is that, <laughs> y'all, you got to be ready and you got to be willing to be an outlier. You feel me? Because in a world of people who are good where they at, complacent where they at, if you choose to do something in any area of your life that um, most people are not doing and it's a level of excellence like it's gonna bring it's just gonna bring a level of excellence another level positivity it's just beneficial what I mean is beneficial to your life bro it's just gonna be you're gonna feel like you're the only one out there doing it. You're you're probably not. You know, there's a lot of people, but you definitely gonna feel that you're the one of the only ones. If you have a friend that's on the journey with you, you're lucky. You know, cause it's not easy. It's really not easy. All right, people will look at you crazy for trying to snatch your life. People will listen to ask not even listen they're gonna ask you straight up, oh how you doing this how you doing this and when you straight up tell them like your method your way of doing something so they're gonna look at you crazy they're gonna think you're unrealistic they're gonna think that you're doing too much they're gonna think that it it don't take all of that whatever it is i'm looking at this <laughs> anyways whatever it is whatever they think they just gonna think now, whatever you're doing is overboard, you know? It's just not, it's not practical, all right? Or I don't know how you want to say it. It's, they just going, they just not going to agree with it, period. I'm, I'm laughing because somebody's watching me. It is weird, but hey, it's what it is. But here's the thing. What you got to do what you got to struggle through, what you have to get it out the mud through, what you have to battle with, nobody knows. Nobody knows how deep it goes. Nobody knows how how deep you are in it. Nobody knows how generations, how this thing, whatever you're battling with, could have been a generational thing that has been following the men or the woman in your family. So they don't know how extreme that you got to take whatever you battle into. Maybe what you battling with, it's not something that they battling with, or it's not something, it's something that they battling with, but they, it's not something that they choose to actually fight. You feel me? Like this could be something in their life that is a problem, but there's a difference between, is it a pro if are, are you actually fighting it or are you just letting that problem take over? You feel me? So it's a difference there. So for my people who decide to fight whatever they're going through, whatever that they see is trying to attack their life or bring down the quality of their life and they decide to take whatever m methods possible to try to overcome what is trying to overcome them you probably gonna look like at them like they crazy we understand like you understand that you of course from the outside and looking in it look like they're crazy but as i'm saying you don't know how serious it is there's some battles that people try to fight that they can't be nonchalant about it that they can't be um they can't be, you know, iffy. They can't be one foot in, one foot out about it. They can't be uh, double-minded about it. There's some battles you face that you got to go all the way in. You got to be willing to max out, sell out on whatever possibility, whatever method that is out there for you to try to overcome what, you come, what you're trying to overcome. Because whatever it is that you're fighting, it's not leaving easy. <laughs> 
it's not gonna go easy it's not gonna go quietly it's not gonna go easy it's gonna make some noise it's gonna make some noise it's gonna make some trouble it's gonna try its hardest to make sure that you do not overcome it so you have to know what you're up against know what you up against and when you see somebody who knows what they're up against don't look at what they're doing and be like oh it don't take all that oh they be doing too much people even feeling like oh they think when you when you going hard and you really disciplined people be like they start to feel like oh you think you better than them you feel me they jealous jealous for what jealous for what do you know how hard this is do you know how hard this is to overcome do you know what I have to do on the daily to make sure I stay in line to make sure that I'm beating this on a daily basis? Because the problems we face, you it's not, not only if it's not a one-two punch knockout, not only it's not a knockout, like I said on the other video, it's not a knockout, it's a wrestle. So it's a, it's a, it takes a little bit of time and it's trying to overpower you. You trying to overpower it. You trying to put it in submission. So it takes a little more time. That's number one. Okay. The, the things that we face, I forgot what I was going to say. Not only that, and the things that we face, they don't want you. It doesn't want, it could seem like it doesn't even want you to overcome okay that's another thing and the, the third thing i was gonna say is this is not something that this is something that you gotta input principles and um make moves every single day to make sure you beat in it if you don't beat it every day little by little there's a chance that it could win you feel me like i'm not saying every day is gonna be a perfect day all i'm saying is the majority of your days there's certain things that we face the majority of our days we better be winning because if we're not winning the majority we losing okay every day we got to make little moves little moves that's necessary to overcome it. every day we got to make decisions a lot of these things is decision a decision that we have to make every day in order in order to overcome and it's hard it's hard having to make a decision every day it would be so easy if you could just make a one hard decision and boom everything works out everything falls in order but as i'm saying there is some battles that's going to take a everyday decision and everyday recommitment to it so that you may overcome it in the long run for the for the long run in the long run long term and maybe even for the rest of your life all right so we gotta understand everybody not everybody not facing what you facing every we all face something different but when you as a person when you decide to stand up and be strong and have some faith come on now have some faith against those things that you face and you you decide to overpower thing the things in your life that are trying to overpower you you're gonna have to get extreme it's gonna have to be extreme it's gonna have you're gonna have to max out whether that's time that's energy that's money you probably gonna have to max out on these things because the limits that you've been living in pr prior previously it's allowed whatever you're facing to run rampant it's allowed whatever you're facing it's allowed it to to win to have the power over you so in order to begin to start having the power over it it's time for you to expand those limits of what you could take expand those limits for what you're willing to do in order to overpower you have to drag it far out hey listen you got me right here but if i expand this and when i say expand if i put more time into this right if i put more time into this if i if i locate more resources that are more helpful to me if i at put some more money into this I, whatever problem that is trying to overpower what i have right here if i expand it more then that's giving me more room to overtake it that's giving me more room to overpower it i'm adding more i'm adding more i'm giving more so because it has me when i'm right here it has me when I'm right here with my time, with my time, my money, my resources. It has me when I'm here. But when I try to decide to add more, expand it, max out, add more, be willing to do more, be willing to go above and beyond in order to beat it. I, I bet you when you start doing that, you're going to see that, hey, 
it can't overpower you there. You could overpower me there, but you can't overpower me right here. Right here, I, I, I took you far out. You know, in battles, in war, in war, what, what they trying to do, a, a, one of a, a war tactic is to get the enemy and bring the enemy so far out of its land, so far out of its comfort zone, f far out of its, from, from its base, that now you have the upper hand because it's so far away from its base, now they're all by themselves so you bring it outside of its comfort zone outside of what it knows so now you have a what is that like a home field advantage or you have an basically a home field advantage over it so that's what we need to do we need to be able to max out expand as much as we can put whatever time whatever money whatever energy we need and that's for the people who really want to overcome these things that's for the people who really want to have the victory over whatever they're facing and to do that you're going to seem extreme to people other people people are not going to like the effort you put in people don't think you're doing too much people going to think you think you're better than them people going to people just not going to understand they're going to look at you like you're crazy they're even going to look at you like you're foolish for everything that you're doing like that that's annoying that's the worst thing like when they look at you like you foolish you don't know what you're doing blah 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 like they know best no, no no you don't know you don't know what i'm trying to overcome and you don't know how serious this is for me you don't know how bad it could be you don't know you don't you don't know what i'm facing you don't know uh how far back this goes you feel me so you, it's you. You as a person who's fighting this battle, you got to understand. You, It's really just you who got to understand what you're fighting, how strong it is, and what level you got to go to. What level you got to max out on so you can begin to have the victory over whatever it is you're facing. Because I'm telling you, if you're losing that battle, you're not investing. You're not putting in enough. You're not putting in enough. Because I believe that you have the power to overcome what you're facing. You just got to be willing to go to levels that you may not see other people go to to overcome. Go to levels or, or choose things. Make decisions that you don't see other people do. That you don't you don't know nobody around you who has put in the, that, that level of work. Who have ascended that high who has done who has tried this method who has been so disciplined you don't know nobody else who, who's doing it like it seems like you're required to do it on you don't know nobody else but you got to do it like that because that's the level you're required to do it on if you want to see if you want to have the victory over what you're facing you may have to do it on a level that no one ever does it before you may have to be more disciplined than you see everybody else every man every woman around you you may have to be more disciplined than you see them being disciplined and it's gonna suck because you're like dang why they don't even have to do all that and they got this and they got that and they don't even have to deal with this because and they don't even have to they don't have to deal with this and i gotta do all of that i gotta put in so much work in order for me to be straight yeah you called to do more you called to be more disciplined. You called to put in more, more of the work. It is what it is. That's what it is for some of us. In some areas, you good too. There's an area of your life that someone's looking at you like, dang, this person don't even have to do much and they got it. Yeah. All right. Everybody has an area like that. Oh, that person, you don't even have to do much and it's good. But everybody also got an area that if they want to perfect that area, if they want to do better in that area, there's, the, there's a level of work that they got to put in that they don't see nobody doing and it's much harder than what everybody else is doing and you got to be okay with that so i'm home so i'll talk to y'all later